Hi everybody, I am Dino Cazares and I'm here to tell you about our new vocalist. Now I know how important it is to all the fans to find the right guy and to carry that legacy. I know how important it is and, 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 and trust me, I took my time finding the right individual for this job. Over the last couple years from like 2020 to 2023 to where we are now, it took a long process. I auditioned at least 300 people, um, different vocalists from all different styles, right? From like rock guys to opera guys that had like beautiful operatic voices. Um, a lot of females, a lot of girls came out. I was like really surprised how many girls really auditioned for this position. And I was like really impressed by a lot of them. During that whole process, you know, the, the whole COVID thing was going on. So it was really hard to audition people. But once it all opened up, I was able to get people out here to audition. And of course, Milo Silvestro was one of those guys. Hi everyone, my name is Milo Silvestro. I'm from Rome, Italy. And I'm really excited and proud to say that I'm the new vocalist for the band Fear Factory. Now, I kind of been following him for the last couple of years because I saw some of his videos that he put up on the New Breed page, which is a Fear Factory fan page. I think I did a cover, a vocal cover of Soul of a New Machine medley. So it was like pieces of songs from that album. So he did a piece of every song and I was like, wow. So he was doing all the heavy growls, all the killer melodic voices and stuff like that. And it was very impressive. I decided to post it on the New Breed Facebook page just to get some people to see it. And fortunately enough, Dino was on that page and he complimented me. He was like, oh, this is amazing, dude. And I was like, wow. And then I kind of like went into some of his past stuff and I noticed that he did a, one of our songs from the Mechanize album back in 2015 where he was playing guitar, bass, drums, and singing. So that was very impressive that he was multi-talented, that he was able to play all those different instruments. Both my parents are pro musicians. My mom is a vocal coach. My dad is a professional blues guitar player and songwriter. I think at the age of 12, I started playing drums and percussion. That was my main passion, passion for rhythm and groove. I needed to let certain things out of my system to start writing lyrics and start learning how to scream, how to do metal vocals, and the rest is history. Again, going back to the whole COVID thing, like once that started opening up and people were able to, the travel ban was lifted, I was able to get him out here from Italy to come do a physical audition. And he knocked it out of the park. The first day he did 18 songs. Every song I threw at him, he knew. So, and he sang it right in front of me. And it was amazing. You know, in the flesh, no studio effects, just singing raw. No, like I said, no effects, nothing, anything major. And you using the studio. And I got to hear him firsthand. I'm like, wow, this kid's very impressive. So he ended up going back to Italy and I ended up uh, auditioning a few other people face to face. Um, but I, I always kept going back to this guy, this, this, this Italian, the Italian stallion. I keep going back to him. We had a big tour coming up, so I needed to, I needed to nail it down of who I was going to pick. So I ended up picking Milo Silvestro. And here we are today in 2023. He is here in LA. We've been working hard and we are getting prepared for this Static X tour. I've been a fan of Fear Factory for many, many years. Real dedicated fan. So this is a really huge opportunity for me. It's like a dream job for me. I know how important it is for all the fans out there that I do a really great job and I'm here to do it. Again, I know how important it is to all the fans that I get the right guy and I know that I got the right guy. And so here we are and we're gonna fucking kick ass.